Got a 1973 Corvette convertible here. The original red car, we just, uh, it's a very recent paint, pretty much brand new. Looks really good. Uh, it's got the Corvette Rally wheels on it, which are in nice shape. Uh, trim rings are a little bit dull. But really good uh, lines on this car. Uh, body gaps are real straight. Top looks to be in really good shape. Uh, looks almost new. No clouding in the plastic, no, no streaks or cuts or anything like that. Uh, interior is really nice. Uh, these look to be probably brand new door panels. Uh, I could say the same for the seat covers and the carpet. Everything else, everything in here looks really nice. Console's really good. Good dash. And this being in 1973, this was the last year you could get a chrome bumper on a Corvette. Of course, it was only on the rear. Front bumper was already plastic by by then. This car has, of course, got a luggage rack on it as well. Again, very nice body gaps here, very even. Hood as well as the uh, headlights. Well, a good drag looks pretty decent. No pitting or rust or anything like that. Uh, rear bumpers do show a little bit of fading here, a little bit of haze. Uh, these are not too terribly expensive to replace. Come around here and pop the hood. matching engine here. This is the original 350. Got the ignition shielding in place. Uh, looks like it's got power brakes. Uh, I do have a set of headers down there. Not a bad little car. And it really wouldn't take a whole lot to be a show car. Uh, pretty nice insulation under the hood here. Looks like it's been replaced recently. Very nice car.